everyone, it's Olivia here. Today, I'm making a video about making your own food for your besties, how to get the required materials for that, and the importance of farming. Of course, you can simply buy the food for your besties, but this is not what I'll be talking about. Again, this is a guide to making your own food. I will also be introducing my pets to you, as I have had several people ask me about such a video, but I figured that just that alone would be far too short. At the end of the video, I will also show you a cool little trick or hidden ability that your besties have, so keep watching. Anyway, let's get into the video. Let's start with some basic information. The first thing after you get your besties is to make a compost bin. In order to make it, you will need 10 manure and 4 wood planks. To farm the wood planks, head to the forest and collect some logs. Then, use the table saw to turn them into wood planks. You will need 5 logs per wood plank. After this, head to the farm and pick up the manure that you find. It's instant and you will get both of these materials in less than 10 minutes. After that is done, create your compost bin. What you want to do next is make soul patches, or if you have only one besties, the ones that are given to you from the start should be enough. I personally have over 10 just because I have 4 little besties to take care of. After you have the amount of soil patches that you want, there are two options to acquire a seat. 1. Head over to the Besties Boutique, click on the little stand, and check the prices for the seats. Their prices vary, so look carefully at what your Besties needs. The other option is to check the marketplace for the seats that you need. They could be cheaper there if you're on a budget. Keep in mind that once you harvest your plant, you automatically get a seed back. So, if you have 3 soul patches that you want to plant carrots in, buy only 3 carrot seeds. They will always come back. Don't worry about them not lasting long enough or anything like that. The only purchase you make is the very first one for the seeds. The next thing I want to talk about is the fertilizer. There are 3 kinds of fertilizer. A met one, a better one, and a wowie one. You should always aim to make the wowie one because it really makes a difference. Those, however, are used and you will need to make more. After you harvest your plants, head over to the Besties Boutique yet again. Click on the desk behind the lady and make the food your Besties needs. And that is pretty much it about farming and making your own stuff. Keep planting seeds and watering them to harvest them and make your own food. It's rather cheap and very quick. Now, about my Besties. Firstly, we have my favorite one, which is also the highest level out of the five. Her name is Amiss, and she is named after my real-life bunny, which looks pretty much exactly the same with very few differences. I don't know if you just heard that, but she's devouring a cardboard box right now as we speak. <laughs> Next, we have my fawn, Lola. Sadly, I don't have a fawn in real life, but fawns deserve to live free anyway. I do, however, have a plushie, and its name is Lola as well, so that's where I got the inspiration. After this, we have my butterflies Lula and Lulu, and they're the cute forest creatures that I wish I could befriend in real life, but alas, the online world prevails yet again. I also have plushies with the same names, Lula and Lulu, but they're not butterflies, sadly. Finally, we have my only cat besties, whose name is Ida. Ida is a cat plushie that I received as a gift from my best friend of over three years, John. And there you go. Now you have met my five besties. However, the video isn't finished yet. I wanted to share with you guys a short clip of what your besties can do, provided that you have the move to skill unlocked. As you can see, I'm currently in the mine and I couldn't get past this puzzle. So I asked my bunny to go there and sit on the tile in order for me to move on. Perhaps this is, you know, well known among the community, but I have not seen anybody else mention it. So, you know, in case people don't know and weren't aware of this, there you go. Now you do know. <laughs> anyway, that was all for me today. If you enjoyed my video, please let me know and I will see you next time. Bye guys.